going to be another rogue stream, bringing in folks watching to hang out. Binding of Isaac's going to work a little bit differently than Spelunky. I'm going to go every two floors. I'm going to switch out people, or if I die, switch out somebody. Then the subsequent person to pick up will choose the character I play as, and will otherwise have a little bit of input throughout. Does that sound fun? Does that, that sound great? Alright, so if you want to hang out, uh, I've got to just call people randomly who IM me on Skype. Diabetes Zero is the Skype name. Send me a message on there, I'll pick somebody at random while those things come in. I will play the first two floors by myself. Then once I clear those first two floors, get somebody, and then get this train going. So to start with, get the chat where I can see it. You know, start with Isaac, gonna go vanilla. And then things are gonna get crazy, okay. That's a good way to start, isn't it? Lost ain't as bad as Labyrinth, though. I'm proud to say I've put in over a 100 hours into this game. Could hardly believe it myself when I saw it on Steam. 100 hours, and I've only beaten the chest once. That's how not good I am at it. <laughs> Who has me beat? Who's put more hours into this? Surely someone has. This game was my first exposure to... Turn the volume down a little bit. This game was my first exposure to roguelikes. Lights likes? I don't know how you kids, crazy kids, define shit nowadays. Oh, hey, Dactylon. You've surely put in more time to this game than I have. I haven't actually played this in a good while. After I beat the chest, I figured, yeah, I'm done. That's enough. I beat the chest with... Who was it with? I think it was either Kane or Isaac. Forget exactly. Forget what I had. It was one of those kind of invincible shields where you had a bunch of flies around you, like a whole satellite of things project uh, protecting you from pretty much every possible projectile you could get. That's great. So again, this is going to be a rogue stream. After I clear the first two floors, I'm going to call somebody random. He or she will accompany me on the next two floors, and so on and so forth, or until I die. When I die, the next person I call will choose the character I play as. That's how we're going to roll on the rogue stream. You see Davo do shit like this? You see him interact with the community like that, huh? I don't think so. He's just not chill enough. Not a fan of the, these sorts of fights where a thing goes underground. I just want to be able to hit it at every opportunity. The one thing that Davo does in his eyes extremes that I need to... I don't know if I need to figure it out. You know, it has that chat in like a small area of the screen. Like, if I could see that, it'd make it easier, because I have to kind of glance over to the right. Hard to do that when I'm trying to precision aim my tears that hurt. Of course, Davo also does, like, giant scare cam, which I would never, ever do. Okay. That's one floor. I could go to the store, but with only six bucks, no hearts to pick up. Well, wait, there's a heart in the treasure room, is there not? Half a heart. Eh, I'll go into the hurt yourself room. Sacrifice some damage, see what's in there. Oh, there's another heart below the store anyway, so. Hmm. <laughs> Gotta apologize in advance if my playstyle frustrates people. So I know there's a right and wrong way to play this game. 
I tend to play conservative. I don't like those, uh, what are they? The things that you give the hearts to and that you randomly get something from. Dectalon, what did I do now? Why are you saying, oh, come on? Did I mess up? Oh, and I have the keyboard on my lap so as not to put clackety sounds on wood. Do you hear clackety sounds? Is it frustrating? Another oh, lost them. Ridiculous. Hope you don't hear too much clackety clack. No clacks. Terrific. You folks are great. I don't know why I didn't hit that vending machine at all, but oh well. I thought I had bombs. But no, it's just a bag full of them that I can't use yet. Tell me about the realism. Dare say there is none. Another store. Got 21 bucks. I could pay to reimburse myself for the key. Get it a soul heart. Random card. Let's have some chat interactivity here. What would you recommend? <sighs> Stream, by the way, is brought to you by... I can't buy both hearts. I got full hearts. I can buy a soul heart, though. I don't want to buy the portable slot, because, eh. Let's see what the card is. Strength. This stream brought to you by Newman's Coffee. That's what I'm drinking. So if you gotta have coffee, have it be Newman's Coffee. It's organic, I think. But I don't know if organic, you know, it still makes my bowels feel like they've been hit with a defibrillator every time right after I drink it in the mornings. That's what you want to hear on your Thursday afternoons, isn't it? What do you say? Gamble, eat the pill, keep the card? Or leave the pill, keep the card? What do you think? Eat the pill. Whoops. The opposite of what you just said. Well, thank you, people. I have the worst luck with rogue streams. I swear. In Spelunky, it's always getting a dark, uh, dark floor or stage. Here, it's just being an unlucky piece of shit. I blame it on you all, y'all. Jackalon, you're in the chat. How many times have you beaten off the chest at this point in your Isaac career? Well, that lucky toe would have been served me better when I got that pill before, you jerks. And that rock thing, that would have been handy when I had more range. What a disaster. That's what that does, right? Things that you hit from farther away are more stronger. Is that right? It'd help if, when I call the next person, if you're an Isaac expert, you know your shit. Oh no, just a straight damage up, the chat is saying. All around damage boost. I'm gonna be a maverick and explore the rest of the floor. Give people more time to phone in. Send me a Skype I am if you want to hang out. On a floor. Set of floors. Two floors. Or until I die. It's Diabetes Zero on Skype.com. Go to Skype.com, register, believe. Mm. Uh, is it worth getting all this money? Spending four bombs on it? I'll get half of the money.
compromise people half the money. Uh, looks like I have a few contact requests here. Let me accept those. And uh, Skype, by the way, is brought to you by Get a Free Dining Plan. When you buy a non-discounted... Who on Skype is going to buy a week-long package to Disney World? I guess families who... <coughs> Skype each other instead of hang out in real life? Would be my guess. What's the difference between this and the regular Duke of Flies? Maybe there isn't one. I don't have the Isaac Wiki handy. That's a thing. If the guest wants to have the Isaac Wiki handy, should I have any questions? That'd be grand. Alright, the 666 or the 966 thing. That's a damage boost, right? Should I get that? Worth the two hearts? I ain't buying that Paul. I hate that Paul. Alright. Consensus seems to be Satan. Way to go, chat. Okay, who do I want to pick here? Kalon Zombie interacted with me in the chat early on, so I'll dial you in in just a sec, Gaunt. Once I hop on the floor. And let's dial you in. Should have done a sound check before and make sure Skype can be heard. Oh, okay. Hello. Hey, Kalon Zombie. You're on. I was about to say Retsu Talk, but it's the beta speed. How's it going? <laughs> That's going pretty good. How's it going with you? Pretty good. Pretty good. Chat, can you hear this fine gentleman okay? Awesome. Apparently they so. Can hear me. So what is up? How has been your post Labor Day week? Uh, pretty good. I guess I'm same as always. Are you depressed? depressed oh, uh, okay, yeah. <laughs> You're gonna kick me out now, aren't you? Absolutely, you are gone. <laughs> oh no. I guess I can't really blame anybody because it is a weekday. Yeah. And it's in the middle of it. What would be a standard work day? Hmm. I would expect a lot more students watching, you know, depressed that they have to go back to school. I know. Procrastinating, don't want to do their homework, so obviously watch Diabetic Man play through a roguelike game. <laughs> roguelite, roguelike. Yeah, what's your uh, what's your position on that? I, I don't give a shit either way. Okay, so, so you would classify Isaac as just a roguelike game? Yeah, pretty much. Okay, that's fair. I had, I had the best run the other day when I was playing this game. I got uh, Polythemus, I got the... Yeah, I got the quad shot, I got piercing shot, and then I had like... I got the cube of meat twice and two pretty flies, so I went to... Uh, I went to heaven to go fight Isaac and I just basically stood in place and just kept shooting him until he died. Impressive. Impressive. So what is your least favorite Isaac enemy? <laughs> Greedheads. Greenheads? The greed heads, the ones that take away your coins when they shoot you. Oh god, those are pieces of shit. Yeah. yeah. I think mine have to be the masks and hearts. Oh yeah, those the, the boss version of that is particularly bad, but I don't mind those too much. Yeah. It's not even that the boss one is hard, it's just really irritating. Yeah. Like you can only hit him from behind. And he just constantly outruns you. Bastard. I know. It's the worst. So how many times have you beaten off the chest? None, actually. I have yet to unlock the chest. I've put like 70-something hours into it. I'm proud to say the first time I streamed this game, unfortunately it's not on my archives because I did this on Twitch TV, but first time, beat the chest live oh. in front of the internet. I was so psyched. See, Did anybody ever see that? Can anyone corroborate my story? I'm not lying. <laughs> I've put 71 hours into the game and I haven't beaten the chest yet because once you unlock hard mode, it just throws too much stuff at you. Yeah. Yeah, like I said, I just put 100 hours into this game and 
Yeah, I didn't play it since I beat the chest, so you got a good 30 hours ahead of you until you beat all oh, the chests. Oh, joy! So look forward to that. Yay! Alright, what do you think? Should I eat this pill blindly or wait until I might need it for something? Eat the pill blindly. Always eat the pill blindly. Good call. Why? What happened? I don't... It's, uh... Because you're about oh, 10 hey. years behind, yeah. Yeah. Tears up. Awesome. I usually play as a cane because the pills Enjoys. usually don't pills usually don't give you bad effects. I've I think I've run into a bad effect maybe once since I started maining cane. I don't think you can't get bad effects from eating pills with cane. Oh, yeah. That's that's I, the beauty of cane. I How thought, did you get a bad I effect? Cain, I don't know. I think cane I thought cane just had a higher luck, just not always good luck. No, he's got like auto PhD. Oh, cane is immune to bad effects. Okay. It must have been somebody else I got a bad effect with, and I thought I was playing as Kane. Probably Samson. Samson's my least favorite character to play as. Yeah, I think I've beaten Mom's Heart with... Let's see, who have I... There's somebody I have not beaten Mom's Heart with. I can't remember who. So, Dectal, if you want to scrutinize my Isaac achievements, and <laughs> feel free. Because I know that's all you do. What else is there to do in Sweden? Nothing. Okay. Nothing. Cat Nine Tails. Cat of Nine Tails. You should go for cat mode, even though Cat of Nine Tails doesn't add to cat mode. What is cat mode? Uh, you get three uh, cat items, and at the same time, and Ugh. you become a cat. And it's, I forget what the bonuses are associated with it, aside from looking like a cat. But hmm. I've never gone into cat mode, to my memory. Neither have I. I haven't. I haven't gotten enough luck to get into cat mode. One time I got two guppy items, and then I died. And then I was like, oh. So have you beaten Isaac? I've beaten Isaac twice. twice. And both times were with Kane, and both times it involved me just standing still because I had a bunch of block shot stuff and just wailing on him with either explosive shots or piercing shots. boy. Basically, if I can get past the womb, I can probably beat the special stages. Let me ask you a question. Sure. Is it weird that I drink coffee with a straw? Hot coffee? No. No, I don't think so. Yeah, Chat, can I get a, a word on that? I, I, I am drink drinking coffee. coffee out of a straw right now. I don't drink coffee or alcohol at all because I'm a weirdo, but... So I can't exactly, like, tell people, oh, you're weird for doing this with coffee when I just don't drink anything aside from water, basically. Cat, why are you playing? <laughs> what a weirdo being healthy and shit. I know. Shame, sir. Hey, Cat, why are you playing with my garbage? Cat, stop it. Do you have any humorous cat stories? Um, not really. <laughs> Except for this one likes to eat plastic and garbage and get in the way a lot. Yeah. Yeah. I had to flea bomb my place today. Oh, joy. I got I got a cat, and I'm treating her for flea. She's got the front line on and everything, but that is flea invasion that's been persisting, so I decided to go with a nuclear option today. Mm. Always go nuclear with fleas. Always. Especially... It'll suck if my cats ever get fleas, which I don't know how they would because they're all indoor cats. But because my mom's uh, policy is if you get fleas, I'm shaving your head. And I have a pretty impressive ponytail I've been growing for the last uh, years. Nice. Yeah. How many years? When's the last time you got a haircut? Um, I just got a haircut recently, but the last time before that, I hadn't cut it in three years after a buzz cut. I did it as a joke, and I kind of regretted it. Because it took me three years to throw my hair back. <laughs> but uh, about every one or two years, I'll donate the hair. Locks of Love? Um, not specifically Locks of Love, but it's another place that's similar. Similar, but different. Locks of Like? <laughs> Locks sure, of, you're okay. Locks of, eh, you're a cool guy. Locks of, eh. Uh... I don't know if I'm allowed to donate hair. I would think I would be, though. Diabetic joke. 
I used to not donate blood just because I figured I had an excuse like, I'm diabetic, no one wants my blood. But uh, technically I can donate blood. <laughs> and I'm the universal donor, I'm O positive. Uh, I don't think I'm a universal donor, I think I'm a universal recipient. You are AB? I think so. Are you positive? <laughs> yes! Yes! Still got it! Oh, sorry. I thought O was a universal... Oh, O minus is a universal donor, someone is saying in the chat. That might be correct. That might be. So what's O... Can I do anything then? Am I worth anything as O positive? Uh, uh, you're worth to other O positive people, I think. Okay. Thought I was about to die there for a second, but <laughs> are you even watching the stream? No. Okay. No, of course not. <laughs> it's binding of Isaac. Everyone's seen this stupid <laughs> fucking game for. Everyone's put a hundred uh, hours into it already. Not everyone. I've only put seventy something. I I looked like twenty minutes ago. I already forgot. Let's get Don't a care. let's get a chat poll. Or maybe I already asked this and just wants to pay attention. Uh, how many hours do you guys put into this game? And have I gotten Curse of the Lost again? Because this floor seems bigger than it should be. I don't remember. I don't recall seeing you. But then again, I was scrambling to put my headphones in. So that way, I wanted to go, Wait a second! No! I'm not ready yet! <laughs> Alright, I guess this is boss time. So after this, we must say goodbye, Kalon Zombie. Oh no! Can I plug something real quick? Of course! What do you got? I am doing a Lollipop Chainsaw LP that everybody should watch because Lollipop Chainsaw is pretty great. You heard it here first. Yep. Oh, dear. Also, also Simply Simon's doing a Mega Man Quattrum, I think he's calling it. Uh, the, the Mega Man 4 for Game Boy. He's doing an LP of that, and that game looks pretty great. The Game Boy one, huh? Yeah. He says that's his favorite Game Boy game out of the all of them. I remember that one being pretty bitchin'. Uh, I never played the Game Boy Mega Man. I think I played that one. I think the only ones I didn't play were the ones where they turned into Planets of the Solar System you were fighting or something. Uh, we can talk about that with whoever's next. Yeah. Thank you Thank so you much for, for your time. It's been Thank you for having me. And you stay safe. You too. Later. What a guy. Was that Curse of the Labyrinth that I was just in? Uh, I don't know. Alright, so... Who is next for this dramatic next stage? Let's... Do... CPU Basic sent a message, but I remember talking to him yesterday. We need new blood. So how's about... Hunter! Oh, and I got some contacts. Yeah. Boom. Yo. Yo, Hunter, what's happening, bro? Not much. Sky Bio so, says you're from Wichita. Yes. It is the most boring city in the USA. Most boring? Whoops. Yes, it that, is. There that was is the wrong nothing button to, to hit. But oh well. What did the sun do? Well, that's the item you don't want to mistakenly use when you don't need it, because it completely cures your health and shows you where everything is on the floor and does significant damage to everything in the room, I think. Ah, I see. I've actually never really played much of this. I have less than 10 hours on this game. Oh, it's a fantastic game. It's a perfect pickup and play games. Chat, should I pick up this Book of Sin? I say go ahead. Do you know what the Book of Sin does? No, not at all. But I have the wiki up. I think it's better than the Hourglass. It spawns a random pickup item, like money. Or sin. Speaking of sin, uh, did you like Final Fantasy X? Yes or no? Um, no. I didn't like Final Fantasy X. Okay, and why? Um, I'm not really a big fan of Final Fantasy in general. Well, why'd you play it then? I didn't play Final Fantasy. So how do you know you like it or not if you've never played the game? This is gotcha streaming right here. It's a catch-22. Boom. 
Uh, but now I played a little bit of Final Fantasy X, and I just didn't really like it. I did, didn't really like any of the Final Fantasies after six and Tactics. Ah, uh, so you didn't like seven either? Not really. I really didn't like any of the characters in seven. Not one. Not one. Not Except even Barrett. Barrett is kick-ass. Not even Vincent Senpai? No. By the way, what does Senpai... Oh. <laughs> well, I guess we're going to have to end it there. Okay, well, it was <laughs> nice talking to you. I'll see you later. Have a good one, Hunter. Wow. Wow. How embarrassing. All right, so we got to get somebody in. All right, I'm going to bring in Dectalon. We got to get a pro a pro player in here. Dectalon, my video game hard video games rival. Dectalon? Hello. Hey. Uh, you really wanted a hug from that bloat fly. From the, the, the fly? exploding fly, yeah. Oh, uh, yes. So, Declan, I need you to pick a character for me. Uh, well, since you apparently haven't beaten Satan with Blue Baby, I, oh, God, I guess you should try that. All right. Uh, I don't think I've is... beaten anybody with Blue Baby. I don't oh. think I've even <laughs> beaten Bomb with Blue Baby. Uh. uh the thing is, uh, Blue Baby unlocks an item for Isaac. I think it's that's how you do it. If you beat Satan with Blue Off. Baby, you yeah. unlock uh, uh, the D6 so that Isaac starts with the D6 so and that's makes him that thing comes a from. ton, a ton better. Yeah. So that is something you should try. So you got to beat off Satan with him. Yes. Okay. Um, what did I just pick poop. up, by the way? Oh, uh, that is a really good item. Um, when you deal a certain amount of damage to enemies, it spawns one of those attack flies around you. So basically, it gives you a huge damage damage bonus. So all right, it's yeah. a it's a really good item. It had a really soul good. heart looking thing surrounding it, so I was hoping it was some kind of free health thing. I think that's poop, actually, but I'm I'm not entirely sure. That's gross. I think it's supposed please. to be yeah. Oh, you do have. I'm poop trying also. to make this stream friendly to everybody, and you have to go you, and do potty humor. You have picked the best game to avoid potty humor, I have to say. Yeah. <laughs> nothing of that in this game. There is nothing. Anyway. This is for everyone. This is the people's game. Yeah. yeah. All right, I guess I'm going to the boss, because I don't want to waste my key on the shop, because without money, and I don't want to go into the hurt yourself room with only silver uh, hearts. How, uh, before you do that, unless you already have, um, since this is uh, the first floor, obviously it's really easy to guess where the secret room is. Would it be right here? It, or up here? It's it's probably next to the shop. All right. Probably. That It seems to be more common. Look than... at this pro dude I got in the call with me. Nailed it, Dectalon. But I'm still gonna not go in the shop, I think, because I want to. I might not get a key on the next floor and miss the treasure. Uh, yeah, I I wouldn't risk it. Uh, what about uh, the uh, uh, super secret room? Would that be here? Um, well, it's harder to guess. Uh, you could eliminate a lot of uh, your guesses by going to the devil room, but you know, since you're playing as Blue Baby, it's more risk. Uh, it's more risky. Hmm. Well, let's lay one here and see what happens. Yeah, sure. No! I failed you. Oh well. Let's oh let's God. let's beat off famine. Try to. Nah, famine's easy. You just had to be the guy who told me to use Blue Baby. <laughs> How is Blue Baby's base damage versus the other characters? Uh, it's pretty good. His his base stats are actually not bad. It's uh, all about the health. It, yeah, it's all about the health. You you can still well, it's all about the health and the fact that he starts with the poop. Right. So he's kind of used to. Oh. Uh, I would I would still recommend like until you get a better item, remember to use the poop because you you can get an item from the, drawing it. What if I'm just morally uncomfortable with using poop as an item? 
Um, well, in that case, you, you know, you, you may have to uh, reconsider your beliefs or go get some therapy or something, Give and then come back and use the poop. Okay. You can do this. All right, floor two. Uh, so we're, we're gonna have a break in the stream now, sending Beatus to poop therapy, but we will be right back. Thank you. I did it. Boop. I can use poop. Uh, should you I go in the arena? Your fears. Oh yeah, yeah, definitely. Especially now that it's oh, yeah, just stuff. Uh, Getting that. It's uh, it's early days. If it was just a health, you could have skipped out. Oh, it is a health, just a health. Well, Why would don't I get in then, I guess. Oh, uh, well, just because if you're rusty, then you might just get hit by a boss and lose the as whole reason I don't, you oh, came into the room. As long as I don't get hit twice, <laughs> then it's an aggregate win. Right? Oh. <laughs> Um, oh, I yeah. thought there was only going to be one fight. No, you there's, told me this would be always, easy! It is easy. You promised. <laughs> <laughs> That's all right, all right, fine. <laughs> it's still easy. That's fair. <laughs> Says Dectalon. Well, you know, comparatively, comparatively easy. It's not a room full of masks. Boom, you lied. That was two fights, not three. I didn't say it was three. You said it would always be three. You promised me, Dr. I did. I'm not sure what, but I did. I'm so sorry. It was a pact written in blood. Uh, the blood pact uh, is definitely <laughs> one of the best items in the game. <laughs> I, I'm just going to segue into that. <laughs> I because, love you know. how your mind works. It's great. Uh, I know. <laughs> Um, Are you a video I'm games just trying professor? to. I I should be, shouldn't I? Yeah. I, I should get some sort of uh, you know. Uh, what is it called? Uh, Degree. Lifetime achievement or something like that. Certification. Uh, PhD. Honor, 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 and eat honorary. a bunch of pills. Oh, yeah. Honorary doctor in video games. That's what I should honorary get. Honorary degree, yeah. From. From university. Sorry. Yes. So do you call Universe. it, in your neck of the woods, is it called university? Yeah. Okay. And why, where does the nomenclature differentiate that it is called college here in the States and just university elsewhere? Um, I think you're a bunch of simpletons. I think that's why. Damn. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. Dectalon there, dishing it out. There are a lot of weird uh, translation like, like there, are, we share a lot of words, but we use different versions of them for whatever reason. People in the reason. chat are misunder mis 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 misunderstanding, understanding what I said. There are universities in the states, but when you ask a student, they would say, "I am going to college." Whereas if you ask anyone elsewhere, even if they go to a university, they still often refer to it as a college. Elsewhere, yeah. it's like, "I'm at universe. I am going to university." Do you see what I'm saying, folks? Do you got that? I I got it. And Thank you. I, I don't even speak English. I still got it. Any English. You were just... I don't know how you're saying things right now or maintaining conversation. I know. It's it's just pure luck. Also, you should have bombed the wall next to the shop before using your key. Well... But now that you got a key, you should open the gold chests. Because there's a good chance that you'll just get another key plus a bunch of other stuff. Didn't I already do that? How far behind are you? Nope. What am I doing right now on the stream? Uh, you're fighting the boss. Okay, so I guess I missed something. Uh, also, the way you want to fight this boss is just to hug the the uh, lower friend. wall. Oh. Well, that too, but like by moving around a bunch, you're making the fight harder for yourself. Like. Mm -hmm. uh, if you just hug the lower wall and just move slightly left and right when he jumps, you will avoid everything, and he can never come up under you. Mm. So, pro tip. No, no, not that wall. The the uh, the secret room is also usually between two other rooms, like Other's between the, the shop. shop and the room with the gold chest in. 
that's usually how the normal secret room is set I up. I need to stop doubting Declan's <laughs> pro stress. See, I don't want uh, that red patch, right? Not with this guy. Oh, uh, I don't see why not. Doesn't I mean, it you don't take have your health? One. Oh, it's only when you take damage, is it? Yeah, uh, it gives you a damage boost when you take damage, I believe. Gotcha. Or I could get the missing page. Or no, <laughs> that's not really anymore. Yeah. The missing page, do you know what that does? Doesn't it randomly do something when you get hit or hurt people? Uh, it's a 5% chance that if you get hit, uh, also you should get the... Oh, you used it already, all right. Uh, Which the, the missing page is a 5% chance that uh, you will use the, uh, you know, the book that deals damage to all enemies in the room? The Necronomicon, I read. Yeah, I never used that item, so that's why I forgot this name. Okay, so I'll get the patch then. We're gonna use that as an excuse, all right? Uh, I know everything about this game, all right? Someone no, in the chat um, asked if there are eight missing pages and all. <laughs> oh my god. I wouldn't be surprised considering there are there is a fair amount of uh, memes in this game. That is true. But I guess Slenderman came after this game. <clears throat> well, Dectalon, oh. you've given me your pro stress, but we are two floors in, so we must say goodbye. All right. Well, good luck. But I will ask to... whoever's next in the chat to just read Do everything so. you say in the chat. Everything you say <laughs> uh, in the stream chat. Because, uh, yeah. All right. So, sounds like a good solution. Excellent. Talk to Good you luck, later. Beast. I seek your advice, as always. Thank you. Bye. That Dectalon hung up on me first before I could hang up on him. Goodness. Rude much? All right, since this is Curse of a Labyrinth, we're counting this as two floors, so whoever gets in next will just be on this floor. Does that sound fair? I think it does. I don't give a shit what you say. Let's uh, go with Michael... Michael. Yes, good job, Dactylon. Couldn't have done it without you. I couldn't have gotten this shitty character without you. Hello? Hey, Michael. How you doing? What's it like having the most common name in the goddamn world? <laughs> it's great. Nice. I should note that, um, in case people think I'm like psychic or something, because people have internet names on Skype, but then when I accept them as a contact, whatever they put their display name as is the one I see. So I got some messages from people yesterday acting like I was uh, a dumb dude, because I was like, I don't see any names that begin with D when I was getting letters from Slow Beef. But there were in fact no D letters, because I was seeing names instead of internet things. Okay? Michael? Right, I have, uh, yeah, I have mine as my real name. God, Michael! <sighs> Glad we got that uh, off our chests. Glad it's cleared up. Yeah, thank you. So, oh dear, got, um, <laughs> sorry. Michael, before I die, uh, what's your experience with Binding of Isaac? Uh, I made it to Isaac, I haven't beat him. Um, play about 40 hours. 40? This seems to be about the median, is about 40-ish. But yeah, I like I've to been... put the JRPG length into it. Right, I haven't played in a couple months now. Yeah, it's been about the same for me ever since I finished the chest. It's like, I'm over this. Then I thought this would be good for the rogue stream idea. It was a tie between this and FTL. I guess I'd go with this. That would be a little more interesting to watch. Your thoughts? Yeah, I, th I think so. Uh, I like playing FTL. I don't like watching it. I think yeah. it's kind of it's kind of slow for a stream. Yeah, I can see that. I mean, here there's just all sorts of things to talk about, like the internet sphere of spiders. Are you afraid of spiders? I used to be. I think I've said this, talked about this before elsewhere, but I saw the movie Arachnophobia when I was probably too young to see it. Oh man. And that was kind of a nonsense movie in, ooh, nonsense movie in retrospect. Uh, it kind of freaked me out back in the day. But if you watched it now, you'd be like, when Tom Petus is a wuss. I've, ne I've never seen it. It's not very good, probably. <laughs> oh dear. Michael, I don't think I'm going to make it. What do you think? I think you got it. I think I got this? Yeah, not, it won't even be close. I think you'll just breeze right through the rest of the game. How about a full health that gives me infinite life? Well, that's next best thing, I guess. At least I'm not as in dire straits as I was. Right, it's just you're climbing back up the ladder. 
It's it's not even going to be a big deal. Oh, I can get the blue candle for seven cents and another health. What do you think, chat or Michael? I should say, just keep the shears or go with the blue candle. I kind of like, like the candle. Yeah, literally everyone is saying candle. I don't think I've ever yeah. actually used this item before. I think I've got it a, a one time. Huh. Oh, that's a chargey item. Interesting. Or not a chargey item, a uh, multi-use item. Nice. It's pretty good. I think it's a good call. You made the right call, Michael. So, Michael, what do you do with your life? Uh, you well, actually, right as uh, watching the stream, I'm filling out the paperwork to start work as a substitute teacher. A substitute teacher? Yeah, pretty pretty prestigious position. So, have you figured out your strategy for when the kids say, like, but Professor Michael, previous teacher lets us do yada yada yada? Uh, no. I'm probably going to end up having to wing it. Wing it, huh? You should come... Come to your first day dressed like Blue Baby, it looks right now. <laughs> just, just look like that. I'll provide the orbiting meat cube for you. Oh yeah, okay. Yeah. yeah. If if you got the meat cube covered, it's no big deal. Yeah, we're gonna we got this. So, uh high school, middle school, elementary school? Uh actually uh just sort of applied for all of them, but it looks like it's gonna be mostly middle school. Oh, middle school, that's the worst. Probably. Yeah. They actually have a campus here that's sort of an experiment that's only sixth grade. Hmm. And uh, I have a relative who works there, so that's how I got into this whole thing. Where do you find experimental sixth graders? Uh, Texas. Texas. Hmm. You heard it here first. The chat's not like in middle school. Yeah, I'm, I can remember middle school, and I can remember me and everybody else being kind of a prick. <laughs> yeah, me too. <laughs> so that's why you chose it. You're like well, I... uh, you're like somebody who has a girlfriend or boyfriend who's kind of the rebel, and you're like, I can change them. I just get to go in every day, and then you know I can leave thinking, well, you know, at least I'm not in middle school. That's true. Uh -oh. oh. Well, that went well. <laughs> Well, Michael, we must say goodbye, but good luck with the middle school thing. Thanks, and thanks for having me on. Yeah, thanks for being here. Stay in school. <laughs> All right, bye. bye. All right. Teachers, we need more of them. So let's support folks by Michael. Tell him that he's doing a good thing, because he is. Teachers are cool. Okay, so next... Let's get friend of the show, friend of Retzer Prey, Mr. DJB. Get some across the pond, some more across the pond culture. Because having somebody from Texas ruined that with Declan. DJB. Hello. What's up? I'm good, thank you. Now, who should I be? I, I, the reason I requested you play this is because I've never actually played this before. I have no idea what this is. Okay, I'll walk you through it. I'll teach you the ropes. I'm an expert. Okay. Okay. Okay, so pick a character. Who do you, who do you like? Who do you like the look of? Uh, lady on the right. The one with the f big hair? Magdalene? I was, I was thinking Magdalene, yeah. Alright, Magdalene's a good choice. She's a tank character. She looks it. She looks like the most joyous tank. Her hair can absorb untold amounts of damage. Fantastic, and okay. She, now she's even more of a tank with this item. So get this. She starts with four hearts. Everyone else starts with, like, less. Whoa, yeah. hello. The item she starts with can regenerate one heart. And the little item I picked up randomly drops you half a heart when you clear a room. Or not randomly, but I think it's every X amount of rooms. And uh, the chat's telling me that the downside to her is that she's also very slow. Yeah. I mean, look at her. She's like, Ugh. I think every character's like that with the permanent crying face. <laughs> That's true. I mean, this is what I look like all the time. <laughs> personally. I mean, I've ne again, you know, knowing full well that this is a Flash game, just watching this, it's it looks like Newgrounds just encapsulated with the blood and the poop and the... <laughs> Realistic. All of, 
Yeah, all of that. But then, on the other hand, it actually looks fun, though, so... It's very fun! Mm. Like I said earlier, this is just the ideal kind of game for pick-up and playing. I should probably go out of my way to get this. I'm surprised you haven't played it. I thought, like, everybody on the internet who had Steam had this game. Well, when you uh, asked the chat how many people, how many hours people have put into this, there are a lot of zeros popping up. Really? Yeah, yeah. I think... I think people who watch my streams just don't play video games ever. <laughs> You'll do it for them. Yeah, exactly. I'll play decades old games for your enjoyment. Hey, why not? So now we got another baby on our face, which obviously gives us more health. Oh, God. Mm -hmm. <laughs> That's uh, delightful. It's great. So what's new in your life, DJV? What's new in um, English land? Over over here in the England, I am currently working uh, working with a theatre group, educational theatre group, which is all fun. Oh, I thought I was the only theatre buff, former theatre buff around. Oh, fantastic. Very good. I did some of that back in the day. As you can I tell, <laughs> with my... Uh, uh, I don't know. I, I say very good, but it's not a sustainable profession, which is why I'm getting a normal job on the sidelines with it. Are you around the London area? It's pretty sustainable there. Um, I am actually. I'm a train ride away, so nice. I've I've actually started looking for acting work in London as well. Nice, Royal Shakespeare shit. I've worked with them before. Way? They're they are fantastic. Yeah, I've heard. Have you been to the Globe? I have. I saw much ado about nothing there. I saw... what did I see there? Oh, what did I see there? What did you see there? I cannot remember. Just put, pull a Shakespeare play out of nowhere, I'll believe you. Macbeth. Yeah, that Yeah, one. I just cursed you. <laughs> oh god, I'm fucked now. <laughs> yeah, I know the theater lingo. I swear to god, the next person who says to me, break a leg, but don't actually break your leg, I'm going to hurt you. <laughs> we all hear that a million times. <laughs> Do you take offense when people in your profession say you unironically good luck? Oh no no no, that's that would just be silly, honestly. It's but it's considered bad practice, but no one really cares. True. Oh dear. Uh -oh. I'm so excited about the theater talk. I'm not paying attention to this incredibly easy fight. You got Macbeth, son. Oh god, I did. What is your proudest work as an actor? Proudest role? Oh god, I um probably actually have to be Romeo. I played Romeo oh. up north in Newcastle. Where far out was that? Hmm? Where far out was that? Oh I don't fucking know. Actually doesn't where for mean why and not where? Yeah, she's asking why are you named why Romeo? Why are you? Yeah, exactly. Yeah. I'm pretty well read. I mean uh, why are you uh why are you a Montague? Yeah, why are you of your heritage? All right, so uh, how is Isaac going then? Ugh. <laughs> Glad we talked about that because that fight takes forever. Chat, should I get <laughs> laser lips instead of the heart, or should I keep the heart and keep my tankness going? Get the laser lips just because the name of them sounds appealing to me. People are saying yes, no, but this wasn't really a yes, no question. But I'm seeing more people. I think they're saying keep the heart, so I'm gonna keep the heart. Oh, is that like a mean thing, a shoop de whoop thing? Oh. Uh, Fine, ignore it then. Ignore all memes. What is the shoot de whoop meme? It's uh, it's like a meme where this... I don't know what it was. It was like a weird blackface thing, but we just fire lasers. That was the joke. Oh. <laughs> it Great. was... Uh, it, was back, it was back in the day of uh, old internet. Wonderful. Old internet. <laughs> oh, this character's so slow. And I probably should have picked up that item. But I wasn't paying attention, and I didn't mean to drop that bomb! You, you say that that item of yours slowly heals you, does that mean you could just stand in place and it doesn't slowly, slowly It doesn't slowly heal you, it's a consumable. That recharges, oh. the ability to use the item recharges after X amount of rooms. You can't just jiggle in and out of rooms if you ever get desperate, though. Correct. Aha. Let's see, should I use my bomb and get this, uh, Liberty, or whatever this thing's called? I'll the let the chat decide. I have no idea what this is. Um, most people say yes. 
looking for different colored rocks. Pro tip, if there are slightly darker gray rocks, that usually means there's items like soul hearts or something. Did you have fun with that fact? Oh yeah, I've, I feel my life is enriched. Good. I've seen this boss somewhere before, probably on a YouTube video. Uh, this uh, played Juliet in your production, right? Oh, y yeah, yeah, yeah. Boy, that was not a pleasant kiss. <laughs> I'll bet. Oh, boy. Wherefore I'll do <laughs> That was just the dress rehearsal. <laughs> Ugh. Yeah, how did... I mean, the costume designer must have had a hell of a time dealing with getting uh, the period clothing on this kind of thing. It was more the symbiotic twin who just kind of levitated. That was the difficult thing. Mm. I mean, we had to work with puppetry, and when that when that fell through, we just had to get a real symbiotic screaming baby blood <laughs> monster. Well, I was going to ask, what happened when Juliet drank the poison, and then her, part of her form died, and then just the uh, flying fetus <laughs> was left? Well, that's the problem. The flying fetus then flew into the audience, killing most of them. <laughs> I would love to see that show. Oh, it was it was amazing, really. <laughs> Rave reviews. It's why it's my proudest uh, achievement, really. The Guardian called it the defining piece of culture of this century. Millennium, even. There we go, finally got it in a trap. Well, one of them said that. The other Guardian reviewer just wrote, Oh, God, help me, over and over. <laughs> right. All right. Well, we got our two floors in, DJB, so thank you for bringing some culture to this cultureless <laughs> chat. Yes, this chat's always cultured, let's be honest. That's true. I have the most cultured viewers in the world. That you do. Anyway, I'll be off. All See you right. later. Have a good one. Give it up for DJB. Successful English actor. Uh, Dexalon, I can't just summon the Devil Rooms out of nowhere. I need help with that. Let's see. Who do we got? Who do we got? We got somebody named Lucas, but looks like he went offline. Michael called already. Let me add some contacts here. Uh, hell, I don't know. Chat, give me a letter of the alphabet. And remember, it's your display name that I'm seeing, not your Skype name. Alright, H. Who do we have H? No H's that I see. Way to go. It's probably a bad idea to ask chat for letters of the alphabet. Alright, I saw an S. S... Yes. Uh, Sarah! Friend of the show, Sarah. Assuming it's the same Sarah. Hello. What's up, Sarah? Hey, Beatus, what's up? Long time no speak. I know, it's been a while. Last time was the, uh... The Retsuthon, wasn't it? Yeah, it was the Retsuthon, yeah. Yeah. Slow Beef was off doing something and I had to man the he show had myself. A, yeah. You had to do it all by yourself. You did a great job. Thank you. I don't <laughs> even remember anything that happened. <laughs> yeah, you might have been imbibing, so, I think. Yeah, maybe. You know, it's all in the spirit of charity and giving. It's true. Oh my god, this room can go to hell. Well, doesn't have that far to go. So. <laughs> well, that's a fair point. Oh, wow. Right? If you got yeah. flying powers, it's handy, but <laughs> can't deal with this. Yeah, someone gifted me this game, which is very nice of them, but I'm really, really bad at these games, so I haven't played more than maybe 30 minutes of it before being like, well... But you've completely finished the game, though, right? Yes, yeah, right. of course. Mm -hmm. Absolutely. I finished it in 30 minutes. So, Sarah, you're in Atlanta, right, if I'm remembering? Mm -hmm. Yeah, I remember oh. the last stream I listened to, you totally knocked our fair city which is fine because i'm not from here so i'm not <laughs> i'm not defensive of it that's fair but i was gonna ask uh you know how's how's dragon con been i'm guessing you um, didn't go but it's near you I so maybe go. You yeah it was really rainy for the weekend so i felt bad for people that went because it was pretty much shit weather the whole time but i think it went well people i knew that had fun saw some c-list celebrities c-listers huh <laughs> 
Do tell. Yeah. Uh, Mythbusters guys. Um, I don't know. It's random people. Any meths get busted? I don't think so. Unfortunately. The myth that it never snows in Atlanta was that busted? <laughs> yeah. Though I did think that your uh, comment about Marta is pretty accurate. It's terrible. What did I say about Marta? You just said that it sucked, which is true. Oh, yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah, I went there for a Falcons game. Oh, wow. Then, yeah, you got the year. experience of... Yeah, so I drove in from... <laughs> yeah, I went there with my dad. We went to... We parked at the... Whatever the westernmost Marta station is. Mm. And then rode that in. Yeah. Yeah. I always hate it, because I used to work at the airport. Um, the beloved Atlanta You worked airport. at the Atlanta airport, really? <laughs> um... And now I'm unemployed. Oh no, kick me out. Um, oh. No, but I would have to take the train all the time, and it would always be awful to get off at like 10 o'clock and then have all the game people be on the train, and you have to just uh, kind of. Right. And everybody's carrying their red solo cups because they don't care about drinking in public <laughs> anymore. Exactly. Yeah, the exactly. most awkward part of going to the Falcons game was the uh, the Falcons won. They were playing Carolina. Mm. So it's a rivalry game for one, and then of course everybody was really hyped up that they won, and then just like cussing up a storm. It's with yeah, my dad, and it's like <laughs> I don't cuss around my pop. This is weird. <laughs> How do I act in this situation? It was just like stay silent and just walk in a straight line. I don't remember what age I felt okay swearing around my mother. I can now, but I don't remember when it was okay. <laughs> I can't swear around my parents. Um, Though I have heard my dad say the word asshole, um, it was referring to some a, a Democrat person. Uh, I remember, yeah. <laughs> Naturally. Naturally. Well, you're from the South. You're a gentleman. Of course you wouldn't swear. Of course. I don't do that fucking shit. <laughs> Speaking of fucking shit, these bosses, huh? <laughs> they are, well, they're not fucking the shit, but they are leaving it. Plenty of it <laughs> behind for us. I don't know what the difference between these and the... Like, this is a unique version of a similar boss. Mm. Oh, that's why. <laughs> Never mind. It's because they split off into bomb mother. Oh, no. Yeah. yeah. It seems like that. So what made you give up on this game? Was it just being bad at it? Yeah, I just... I feel like if you didn't grow up playing the type of games where you had to die over and over and keep trying again and again, you never build up that tolerance of, like... Not giving up. It's like drinking beer, yeah. Yeah, exactly. You gotta build up that tolerance. Yeah. Oh dear. Oh, yeah, it's made it. doubly difficult by the fact that she moves so slow. Yeah, I was gonna say she's really slow. Did you have a chance to get a heart back from your little happy friend? Not, Not in this room, it. unfortunately. <sighs> if only I were like Dectalon, who literally grew if up only. playing this specific game. He was raised playing Binding of Isaac. <laughs> he was trained. It was like the Hunger Games shit or something. Yeah, I hear they do that in Sweden. They do, yeah. Woo! There we go. You did it. Fortunately, we still got a lot of health. Let's see. Oh, I never got the treasure on this floor. Because I did not. I can't believe it. you forgot about the treasure. Oh, I could forget about the treasure. What's your uh, position on Nicolas Cage? Um, Mild amusement. Mild amusement? It's fair. Yeah. What's he done lately? He's kind of dropped off the radar. Yeah, I don't think he's really done anything. I don't know. It's disappointing. I actually watched The Witcher for the first time, or The Witcher Man, or Wicker Man. Why am I saying Witcher? The, the, for the Witcher first Man, time. Yeah. The Witcher Man, yeah, for the first time um, a couple weeks ago. Nicolas Nicolas Nicholas Cage is going to be in the uh, movie adaptation of The Witcher. <laughs> to be fair, so I, can I can see, see that. Where the yeah. Come from, yeah. I don't know who else you would pick for that. No one. Speaking of Witcher, what games are you playing lately, Sarah? Um, I've been playing a lot of XCOM Enemy Unknown. Uh, XCOM, yeah. It's pretty fun. I tried Excellent. playing that and just... Um... <laughs> it's it's not easy. I mean, you can play on easy and then it's you know still relatively well, easy. Well, I would feel like less of a person. <laughs> yeah, everyone would judge you. Yeah. It would put a big alert on your Steam account and then all your friends would know. <laughs> I can't let be known. I mean, Declan already stalks my Isaac achievements. I can't have him seeing that I'm doing an XCOM on easy. I also bought um, Game Dev Tycoon while it was on sale, and that game is really, really fun. It's just satisfying. It's very simple. How does that game work, exactly? Um, you slowly unlock genres and things, so you can choose to make a post-apocalyptic, and then you can choose, you know, RPG action, casual 
things like that, and you can choose. I like to have a real cash like, post-apocalyptic game. <laughs> yeah, you yeah. can choose if you want it to be for young people, everyone, mature, and then as you make games, you kind of learn that, okay, mature games work well on the PC, um, young games don't work well on the Xbox or whatever. Mm. So can like you that. choose really, uh, can you choose combinations that would not naturally fit, like post-apocalyptic rhythm game? Yeah, yeah, things like that. And you can actually, you make, games for publishers in the beginning so they'll be like i want you to make a post-apocalyptic game for young people for our console and then you do and it's never going to work because it's not a good combination so then you lose money uh but pokemon that's true you that can have pokemon a... be said anywhere um, there was a point where i was in the red i had negative money and all the banks were like we're not giving you any more money so i made a virtual pet strategy game called It's a Cat and it made $60 million. <laughs> so I think there's a bit of an RNG element to it. Where it's so wait, a real-time strategy cat game? I guess so. I thought it, you know, had the, <laughs> had the potential. There will be a StarCraft expansion based on your game <laughs> dev hygiene game. That's uh, another game that I could get into, StarCraft. I could get into it for a little while, but then when it came to the multiplayer, I just kind of gave up. Mm -hmm. That's another game that Sage Dectalon taught me well on, but... Is there a game that he's not good at? Uh, I beat Mega Man Unlimited before he did. Ah. I'm pretty proud of that. Dectalon admits that StarCraft is hard, so... Yeah, Dectalon even had uh, some analysis on why I was better at the game than him. I can't remember exactly what he said, though. <laughs> Something about... Nice. Uh, no, no, diabetes probably or something. Or yeah, it's... American supremacy, I think he said once or twice. Sounds about right. Nice. So you're seeing Isaac? You're feeling like getting back into it? Yeah, maybe. Why not? I feel, I feel, uh, inspired. You'll feel such a level of satisfaction from beating off the chest, if you can get that <laughs> far. Oh, there's an arcade. There's an arcade. I haven't been here in any of these runs yet. See, the arcade is one of those things in this game that I'm just not good at. Mm. So I'm going to ask the chat to pick a skull for me. Pick a skull, any skull. Or maybe I should ask you, Sarah, since you're in the call. Did you follow whatever was under there? Um, ooh, that went really fast. Come on. I want to say the right one. All right. This right. Oh, good job, Sarah. Nice. You got... <laughs> Let me put shit on my head. That's how good you are. You definitely need more shit on And I got head. a crystal ball, which I don't remember what that does. So chat, chat I need a... Ball do? Yeah, I need a chat and analysis on that crystal ball. Seeing one person say, take it, take it. Uh, what does this do? Reveals the map. Reveals the map, huh? Uh, alright. Oh, and gives you a soul heart. Soul hearts for cards, yeah. Oh, nice. Oh, yeah. That's a keeper. Well, this room was a success. I'll say. So we got a secret room. So uh, another chat analysis opportunity. I'm going to check out the secret room. Should I explore the rest of this floor? Or go to the boss room after I get the treasure chest? This is why we stream. <laughs> so you don't have to make any decisions. Exactly. <laughs> I don't want to be capable of independent thought. Hey, accidentally. Well, not accidentally, because I knew it was there. Mo money. Mo money. I was going to say there's That's no it. downside to the money. <laughs> that just is what it is. Sarah, what's the chat saying about the exploration of the floor? Um, They are oh, saying yeah. oh. explore. I feel. That is the... Oh, I thought the flies just killed themselves when they flew into your poop thing, but they just don't harm you. Oh, they just hang out. They're your yeah. friends now. I got a joker. I think that's good. You just look really see, pissed about <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, and we got homing bombs. Maybe this is a prelude to getting a Dr. Fetus thing later. Do you know what that mm, does? I do not. It turns your tears into bombs. Oh, wow. Yeah. That sounds pretty handy. Let's see, chat is saying use the joker. Dectalon is agreeing, so... What do you think this will do? I think it will randomly give you something. <laughs> that is my okay. guess. And there was so much build up there and it just kind of... I just, I went nowhere with it. Kind of petered so. out. This devil room kind of sucks. The tale's where you go down to one health and have nine lives, right? 
And then the quarter just gives you a quarter. Quarters. Or is the cat tail more thinking of something else? Well, someone was saying if you get all the cat items, you become a cat, but I don't know if there are other things. I'm not interested in that. Yeah, all right. I want everyone in the chat except Dactylon to tell me what to do right now. The tail increases the chance of getting gold chests, says Dactylon. Hmm. Hmm. So, Dactylon, is that worth the sacrifice of one out of six health? Or should I get both of these things? Or none of these things? Or one of these things? Everyone's saying the tail. All right. Ah! <laughs> ah, that noise made me scared. Guppy's tail. All right. So I guess we'll go to the shop as well. Let's see what we got. So what's your cat's name? My cat's name is Sam. Oh, that's a good cat name. Mine Short for Lola. Samus Aran. <laughs> Mine is named Lola after Run Lola Run, because that's what she does. Nice. She runs away. She just runs everywhere. That's how she plays. She oh. just zooms around. Oh, I thought you were just a bad good. mother and she was trying to get away from you. <laughs> yeah. yeah. And it's a small apartment, so really she just exhausts herself. Okay, time. gotcha. Now, Sam doesn't run. She's one of those uh, loves everybody kind of cats. Yeah, mine is... I've spoiled her. I blame her behavior on myself. She just needs constant attention all the time. Does he... Oh. Wonderful. Not reacting to your cat, reacting to having to fight this boss. Ah. Greed, as they say, sucks. That's a quote from Wall Street. Uh, yeah, Wall Street. <laughs> yeah, that's that's what they say. Yeah. It's definitely the motto of Wall Street is greed sucks. Son of a bitch. I hate, I hate these things because every time they hit you, you lose cash. Oh, yeah. Money falls out. That's not good. Less money, more difficulties. Is the is the saying. Less money, less money. I think. Yeah. Oh yeah. That's right. Yeah. <laughs> Fortunately, I'm small with the liberty cap, which makes oh, yeah, me harder to hit. I know I have tiny poop on my head. All right, chat. Should I go for those other rooms or just go to the boss? This is my way of asking: Should I get rid of Sarah as soon as possible, yes. or <laughs> you alone yeah. decide my fate, right. chat? Aw, y'all are nice to me. Alright, other rooms it is. The chat is pro Sarah. Well, thank you. And you're all spelling my name right with no... Everybody always spells it with an H, but it is without an H. So thank you. Ah. How uh, many difficulties did you have growing up with people misspelling your name? Um, most. <laughs> I don't think... I don't think I've met many people that would spell my name correctly, which is fine. I'm not, but I don't get I'm used to people spelling diabetes with two E's. Yeah, I think that I did that for a while, to be honest. Oh, Sorry well, that. fuck you. <laughs> confessions in this. That is wrong. <laughs> Red Supreme Confessions. I just feel like I want to be honest with you. That's good. I appreciate honesty. It's all good. Oh, dear. Ugh. I got trolled. No. I didn't get to the trolling yet. Oh, I see. Yeah, so another facet of this game I'm not very good with is these blood machines. Yeah, what do they do? Well, you f give them a heart, they give you cash. Mm -hmm. But at what cost? That's true. So, I'm, my instinct is to bomb these things. But Yeah, I feel like that's logical. So, yeah. chat, would you agree with that assessment? Just explode it? What do they think? Get the blood. I don't know how to get the blood bag. Blood for the blood god. All right, I'm just seeing some boom it, so I'm gonna boom boom the shit. Yeah, I think that's consider it boomed. <laughs> All right, we got one more room and then the boss. So the bosses are randomized in this game. They sure are. I wish there was a little more variety in them though. Maybe it's just because I've played the game so many times. That That's they... true, yeah, once you put a couple hundred hours into the game, it's not... <laughs> a couple hundred? It's all the ways to go on that. Oh yeah, you're so... Singular hundred. So you moved to Atlanta, you said, from... Uh... Pennsylvania. Pennsylvania. Yes, near what... Pittsburgh. And it's because your dream was to work at the Atlanta airport growing of up? Of course, yeah, as yeah. soon as I heard of that it existed, I did everything I could. <laughs> no, I just, um... 
I had to take a break from school for some reasons and I thought it would be fun to come live with my friend down here because I'm from a very small town, like 14,000 people. So oh, gotcha. visiting the big city, I was like, wow, there's stuff to do and restaurants that aren't chain restaurants. It's true. Um, and but, Marta. And Marta and the terrible heat that I hate so much. Oh yeah, don't get me started. Summers, oh, I can't. Well, I don't know about Atlanta, but at least in Alabama, the summer's been tamer than most. Yeah, I mean, they're saying that this year it wasn't as bad, but it's always bad to yeah. me. Last year, I think, was worse, but... It's the humanity. Uh, not as well get you. It's that feeling that you get. It feels like the air sticks to you when you go outside. <laughs> yeah, that it gets in every... Yeah, but the like, winters are great. I hardly even call them winters down here. We oh, didn't yeah. get snow last year. Just put on a windbreaker and you're good. Mm -hmm. If even I that. I, I was working at the airport, um, I think it was three years ago, when we had a quote unquote bad snowstorm where we got about three inches of snow and then things over it. Um, and every plane was grounded. There were like 800 canceled flights over three inches of snow. It was a total mess. It's good when the busiest airport in the world reacts to it. It is, to, yeah. Uh, it is, yeah, literally the busiest airport. It literally is, yeah. And I was on the Delta Concourse, which is probably the busiest concourse. Ah, uh, Delta. Ah, uh, Delta. How I loathe that I'm forced to fly you most of the time. Oh, you are? That's the shame. Well, yeah, how it works flying out from Alabama is just hop over to Atlanta, and then you can go pretty much anywhere you want. Yeah, Atlanta is the hub. But, you know, it's like a 30, 20 to 30 minute flight to Atlanta. Yeah, so you go up and then immediately go down. Yeah, pretty much. You don't even have time to put in any of your electronic devices. It's like, all right, you can turn on electric. Okay, now you need to turn them back off again. Yeah. All right. Well, was that two floors, Sarah, or was that one? I don't know. <laughs> kind of get, the conversation's been that engaging. Chat, uh, how? what have I done? Chat, please remind us what just happened. What must I do next? That was one floor? It felt like a long floor. It did feel like one. Wait, okay, now I'm saying now I'm seeing two floors. Okay, well, you're feel, you can bring someone else in. Someone says it was three, you conned me! <gasps> oh no. I can't believe you called me out like that, Smash Daisaku. <laughs> I'm gonna remember that name for the rest of my life. Well, Sarah, thanks so much for hanging. Thank you. Stay I'll frosty. See ya. Later. Later. Give it up for Sarah. Retsu Pal. So let's see. So disorganized with my Skype list. Um, let's do. Oh, I'm intrigued by the name Test Object. So, look okay, at Test Object in the call. Apparently from Belgium, hailing from Belgium. Archip Cola, send me an I am on Skype, and we'll get you in the queue, my man. Assuming you are didn't already. All right, Belgium, on the line. Test object. Hello. Oh, holy shit! Can I? <laughs> Did I just hear myself yell? I did you. Are you oh, hearing hi. yourself in the future? I, oh, I hear I myself did. saying hello. Hang on one second. <laughs> I'm hearing echoes of the past. I gotta hear myself saying hello. Oh my god, I sound terrible. I'll put on a. <laughs> sound... <laughs> Shit, how could you make me hear this? Oh my god, I sound terrible. I'll put on a. Hear the stream! What if I unmuted my stream? So would it like be a double kind of echo? What would happen? Hello. Hello. Is this better? It is. That. Oh yeah, that's way way better. How's it going, test object? I'm doing okay. So you hailing from Belgium? Uh, yep, indeed. Uh, how's the weed? I'm hearing a million different voices at the moment. Oh, you're crazy. <laughs> <laughs> Do you have the internet muted? No, I don't. And now I have. Yeah, you gotta mute the internet on there beat to speed when you're live. 
So that was the perfect intro? It was the perfect intro. I, I think I did the best intro so far. You did. So why don't you make it up to the chat and tell us about yourself? Um, I'm Dust Objects. Uh, I do animations on new grounds. <laughs> oh, uh, have we made fun of one of your animations? Hmm? Have we made fun of your animations before? Uh, not yet. <laughs> Should we? No. <laughs> uh, well, says the artist. You can, but it's... Meh. <laughs> what sort of animations? Oh god, um, what are they like? That's actually a good question. Um, like stick figures killing each other? Uh, no, not that bad. They're, they're, they're okay. <laughs> they're stick figures um, complimenting each other. Yes, actually. Uh, I've, I've never, I've, uh... Are you Michael Gibson? No. Okay. <laughs> no, um, basically I just do some... I'll, I do all kinds of stuff. I made, like, two games. One of them featuring Billy MC. <laughs> what? Um, Pardon? Well, he makes a little cameo. <laughs> like you literally got him to talk, or you no, animated no. a likeness of him? I, a likeness of him. Oh, okay. He, it, it's it's in good fun. It's it's not in nothing evil. <laughs> nothing <laughs> Just a little cameo. And uh, what what was this animation about? Oh, that was a game. Oh, the game. Sorry. Uh, uh, what was yeah, the game about? It was, it was basically like an excite bike, uh, not like a, a callback to excite bike. You were a, a Knight on a motorcycle. Hmm. All, all in NES style. And what did Billy MC do? He was an opponent. Um, yeah, that's basically it. An anti bicycle <laughs> person? Oh, no. <laughs> no, no. He was uh, were racing for the princess and he wanted to be part of it. He'd be part of the big boys. <laughs> <laughs> and did you get a daily first place? Uh, no. I think I got a... I don't know, actually, what that got. daily last place? Oh, well, obviously. <laughs> um, well, I, well, let's... I can tell, actually, by the way. Uh, this got a... Nothing. <laughs> it, was, it, it was okay, but the timing on Newgrounds voting lately has been really off. <laughs> Something's wrong with Newgrounds voting? Um, I, I, I know. It's, I find it's that amazing. a little hard to swallow. <laughs> it's, 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 you wouldn't believe. <laughs> Alright, how, okay, you're from Newgrounds, how would you rate my stream so far? Uh, two out of five? So you love nah, it? Let's go with a five. Oh, good. <laughs> so you hate it? I don't know, we just press buttons. <laughs> <laughs> That's the Newgrounds logo. Oh dear. But, by the way, I, I actually like really love Binding of Isaac. I've played the shit out of it. How many hours you put into it? Oh, like 130. Oh, you even got me beat. Have you beaten off the chest? <laughs> uh, yeah, I I think I beat off Satan with... Oh, that's gross. Okay. <laughs> uh, Whatever. Watch, watch the language on the string, please. <laughs> oh, sorry. <laughs> but yeah, um, I, I I also just really love the guys behind it. They make amazing games. Did you uh, play the shit out of Super Meat Boy? Yeah, totally did. I they're, did they're too, but I did not beat it. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> All right, just ending this. All right. Um, they're, they're actually making a new game, by the way. Do you know? I think I heard about it in passing. Uh, what's it about again? Uh, Mugenics. It's. I'm not entirely sure, but it's got a lot to do with cats, so you may like it. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not a cat, crazy cat person. Oh, wait, you're not? No. <laughs> if, if I were that, I would be like, I would pick up the cat, have it hover near the microphone all the time. And ask it questions about what are you what are you doing on that microphone? Kitties kitties can't do let's play. You know, I'd, I'd be I'd say those kinds of things, which I don't. You'd you'd get more views. I might get more views, possibly. Um, chat, would you watch uh, more of my streams if that was how they were done? Just a quick informal poll. <laughs> Someone said I have slow beat for that. That's fair. <laughs> That's true. It's, yeah, yeah fair enough. 
So, but test yeah. object, do you make a living out of animating stuff, or do you do something else for the paying the bills, the Belgian bills? I, I plan to in the future, but uh, right now I'm working on my masters. In uh, animation? Uh, yes, in animation. Nice. Um, so, yeah, that's... <laughs> that I'm also I'm gonna make a game for for it as well, but that's like in the far future, it's far off. So, would new grounds be better if having a master's was required before you could submit anything on it? Um, no. <laughs> <laughs> no. To be to be fair, like new grounds, it's not as bad of a place as like you guys joke about it, obviously, but it's not that bad. There's a lot of shit, don't get me wrong. Mm. Like, have you ever been in the art portal of Newgrounds? The art portal? No. It, you have to see the, the shit that, get posted, that gets posted there. <laughs> the, like, the, if you put, put off the, out, like, have the adult filter, like, allow adult stuff, it's no. just one page full of porn. <laughs> <laughs> Excuse <laughs> me, joking. I think the word is art, sir. <laughs> well, obviously. <laughs> It, that's the greatest thing, like, in the reviews, everyone is trying to actually, like, look at it from an artistic standpoint. It's pure porn. They're trying to justify <laughs> them jerking off? Yes. <laughs> Absolutely. Amazing. Yeah, I, I've, al I've almost, at one point, been, like, thinking about actually doing, like, doing a, a, ret a Retsu whatever uh, on that sort of stuff. Retsu fart? Something like that. <laughs> oh, boy. Basically, just like... They're like the best of the reviews that you that you guys have ever brought up. They're the best off. <laughs> <laughs> I'd love to see that. Personally, oh, definitely. It's, it's worth checking out. <laughs> my response to that would be exactly like these enemies I'm fighting right now. Oh. <laughs> yeah, much about, much about that. How much maybe, do you uh, hate more. these things? So... Uh, how much do you hate these things? Was the question. Oh, not that much. These, I, I think these are okay. Like, okay, I, I but find when you get a thousand fast ones. I'm not. I'm not that problematic with them. The ones I am problematic with is like the the worm things. If they are in corridors, mm. I absolutely can't stand those. They are just like rooms that are bound to hit you. Right. Just, just, just gonna say, yeah, I'm gonna take a heart away. Okay. <laughs> Bastards. So, um, I forget if I asked you this and it got lost while I was uh, beating things off, but uh, have you beaten off the chest, I'm assuming? Uh, yeah. With how many characters? Oh, uh, Jesus, I, I lost count. <laughs> you lost count? There's only like seven of them. <laughs> Probably all of them, but like I don't know the amount of times. <laughs> I like, probably multiple times with uh, with every character. Oh yeah, I had homing bombs. <laughs> probably a good thing to remember. All right, so I can fight a sin below me, or I can fight the boss. Mm. What do you think, Mister Belgian animator guy? Uh, I don't know. Um, I usually just go for the boss. Okay. I, I try to ignore the most of the Sin guys. I will fight the boss and ignore the Sin guy, but first I'll pick up all the health that I missed. That you should do. Because I forgot Chad's been... Oh, she's moving so slowly. Yeah, you still haven't gotten uh, like a quickness, a swiftness item? I have no, uh -huh. no swiftness items and no damage up items. Oh, that's crap. <laughs> so I got a tank who can't really hurt people very much. Makes me sad. What would you say your favorite items? My favorite item, um, I like the Polythemus a lot. Mm, yeah, yeah. Of course, there's your Epic Fetus and Dr. Fetus items. Mm -hmm. The lasers. Yeah, the lasers are great. I, I've never managed to get to both of them. You can get both? I, I don't know. <laughs> I think so. Uh, what does the Empress do? I don't remember. Does it stomp on the enemy and hurt him? Uh, yeah, the Empress was the oh, mother. No, it doesn't. <laughs> no? Am I wrong? 
it gives you the uh, Whore of Babylon status. Right, yeah, the horrible minds, yeah. Which is good in that I can hurt the guy more, but... Oh, Loki. <laughs> I'm wondering if there's like any way to defend uh, the meme jokes in this game. Defend because I them? think it was... Yeah, because they're, honestly they're pretty crap, like, looking back on, on them. Uh, I just kind of disregard them. I mean, they're there, but they're not detrimental mm. to the actual play experience. No, uh, that's true, that's true. You might roll your eyes at them a little bit, but they're not egregiously offensive or anything. Have you ever seen that Kickstarter guy who wanted to make a tower defense game purely out of memes? No. Oh, he's hell. I... <laughs> <laughs> He's just like one of those persons who, like, the, one of the only persons where you can give me a gun and I'll shoot him. <laughs> I know that's grim, but Goodness seriously. It's some dark <laughs> shit. I, I have dark secrets. God. <laughs> so tell us uncultured people in the chat, what's Belgium like? Uh, it's okay. It's not bad, uh, honestly. Um, you have a lot of food. Lots of food, that, yeah. That's a thing. Um, like, we have, we have probably all the food in the world we possibly could have dreamed of. Um, that's kind of an unfair monopoly. Yeah, I, I suppose, but, you know. <laughs> Goodness. Uh, just share some of the food. Belgium's where, where not, it's Amsterdam I'm thinking of, where he, uh, weed's everywhere. Yeah, that's Amsterdam. Amsterdam like, that's right. Holland's Holland. I get uh, my Euro zones mixed up. That's okay, Belgium is like tiny. It's you no, know, you you'll to totally look over it. Mm. Um, what else is there about Belgium? It's very Belgium? it's a very confusing land. Confusing. Like, politically, like it it we have every language pa pass by in this country. <laughs> you have all every the food and all the languages. <laughs> yes, we do. But it's okay. <laughs> that is not okay. <laughs> Well, that's kind of redundant right there, isn't it? Oh boy, this floor is going to take a while. I think I'm going to make a beeline for the treasure. treasure then or you could commit suicide if you want to get rid of me. Well, it's not that I want to get rid of you. It's just that I hate having a sluggishly underpowered character. Yeah, that's fair. But that's at the fair. same time, one who can survive quite a lot. Mm. What I could do... Nope. Well, nah. Well, you could, could just go for the boss room and then come back somehow. I could, but I feel like I need the treasure. Mm. What, what's your stance on treasure? Treasure. Uh, it's okay. Um, I don't know. Mm -hmm. uh, <laughs> Favorite uh, Isaac items? Oh god, I don't know. Uh, yeah, like the 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 Cyclops thing. That that's mm -hmm. I love that one a lot. But also uh, the, which one is it? I, I've once uh, had bomb like, uh, what's it called when you uh, sh shoot bombs out of your eyes? Doctor Fetus. Doctor Fetus, yeah. Yes. I have that like I had that a couple times with a boomerang. That shit. <laughs> Wait, boomerang? Yeah, there's like a boomerang power up where all your tears come back. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I had that a couple times. That's hell. I think that's a mirror, isn't it? Yeah. I, yeah, my reflection. Oh, cool. that tears down pill is killing me. <laughs> what do you think, chat? Should I suicide this terrible character or keep going? Or I could just leave. You don't have to suicide. It's not, it's not your fault. <laughs> I'm not blaming you. I like the Belgians. I hear your waffles are excellent. That's the only thing we have. Yeah. <laughs> I lied about the food. <laughs> you have all the food. Uh, you have all the food as in the form of waffles. <laughs> Everything. You got bacon waffles, vegetable yes. waffles. Yes. All, all things. Waffle shapes. Chat. What's your favorite kind of waffles? What are your favorite kind of waffles? Being a Belgian gentleman. Oh, there's, there's actually...